not disastrous seemed to be the general mm. sense and the aftermath of the game as well. Tockett said he didn't have an update, but he didn't think. I don't know if he used disastrous. He might have used. How did the operation go, Doctor? Oh, not disastrous. <laughs> Which is always, you know what? It's better than being disastrous. <laughs> That's medical terminology for you. Um, yeah, this is obviously slightly concerning because we don't know for sure how it's all going to play out. But uh, I, I'm not in a panic yet, and I haven't been in a panic uh, at all, really. First off, the Canucks only play twice this week, Wednesday versus Colorado and Saturday versus Washington. It's not a big deal whatsoever if Casey DeSmith has to play those games. Um, I found it reassuring that Demko was even able to give DeSmith the heads up mm -hmm. that he might have to come out of the game. Um, and DeSmith shared that after the game with reporters. When Demko left the ice, it didn't look like a catastrophic injury or anything. He just left under his own power. Uh, but until we know for sure, there's obviously a certain level of worry that comes with the star goalie being forced to leave a game. Uh, the Canucks' top players have been remarkably healthy. Uh, this season, and it's a big reason why they're in the position they're in. Mm -hmm. And the Canucks, you know, they still have seeding to play for as well. It would be great if they could win the conference, although maybe not if they get Vegas in the first round, but I digress. We'll talk about, we'll talk about that later. Um, you know, I, I, I just, for whatever reason, usually, you know, I'd be like, oh, I put a damper on things. For me, it, I guess I just wasn't wasn't that worried about it, and I and I really you know people were like, oh, "That's new for you, bro." Like, it was such a good performance against the Jets, and such a such a complete destruction of a pretty good team. And people will say, "Well, the Jets retired; they're playing the second of a back to back." Yeah, they came into that game six and zero in the second of back to back, so that was their actually that was their specialty. Uh, the Canucks really played well on Saturday, and they seemed to be out of whatever funk they were in, um, maybe it was the schedule, maybe they were tired before coming out of the All-Star break, but uh, the good vibes are back, and I refuse to let a uh, not-disastrous injury to Thatcher Demko ruin these good vibes. That needs good to be in, you, Jason. That needs to be yeah, in brackets, by that. the way. Mm -hmm. when, when, they, when they list what Demko's injury is, it should be Thatcher Demko brackets, not disastrous. Yeah. Uh, we're not going to kill disaster. the good vibes. We do have an update from Rick Dollywall, regular guest on the Halford and Bruff show. He from Check TV, Donnie and Dolly. Uh, uh, just a few minutes ago via the Twitter machine, Rick writes, Demko will miss a few games. Expect the Canucks to call up a goalie. It's not his groin or previous injury. He heard my Toronto comment. Uh, not I my groin. Yeah. Uh, so in the interim, you're going to get to see a lot of Casey DeSmith. And I suppose... We're going to have the discussion. Is there a discussion here, Laddie? I assume it'll be Seelovs because he has the experience. Tolopilo's been better. But Tolopilo's been yeah. better statistically, and I think he's got a it'll little bit more of a run. But I think it'll it's going to be Seelovs, and he won't play. Seelovs yeah. let one in from center the other day. I saw um, that. Yes. Here's like Seelovs, here's your baseball. He's cap. not the hot hand. We'll put yeah. it that way. That, yeah. might, hurt give that might hurt him in practice. No, why? Just for the hell of it. Oh, okay. Just do it. Well, We're you know what? Cocky, are we? It, they cowards. are in a position do to do it. what the hell of a game. I wouldn't do it against like Colorado on Wednesday. Nah, do it. <laughs> look, look at look at their schedule. Look at their schedule over the next little bit. They got Colorado on Wednesday. That's a tough one. Okay, but yeah, they're, okay, just, you see who's just, been starting for Colorado? Just, just, okay, they're all at home. Uh -huh. They're all at home. Let's not get distracted. Like you, you, both of you got distracted there, and we're one game into this. Colorado on Wednesday, mm -hmm. Saturday against Washington, and then. You get Sunday, Monday off, and you host Buffalo. Not a great team. Thursdays, Montreal. Saturdays, Calgary. Like, the Smith can play all those games. Oh, yeah. No, it's just There's no gets... reason why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tolopilo yeah. can play looks... Buffalo. I was shooting down Andy's idea of just throwing Tolopilo game. Although that <laughs> Buffalo it. game yeah. it does kind of smell Come like it does kind of feel like a Tolopilo game. <laughs> Buffalo, Tolopilo. Let's start it. Let's start it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Justus Annanen has been starting for the Colorado Tolo Avalanche. Tolopilo, Tolopilo. That's, that's the game for me. All right. Uh, let's, let's collect our thoughts here, shall we? <laughs>